Hey, what is going on, Indianapolis? I'm Tolan. And I'm Big Ben. We are the Do It Indie Guys. Welcome to this week's top five urban events. We're awesome. looking at the week of uh, February 8th through the 14th. We had to throw uh, Valentine's Day in there. So. Yeah, especially because it's Tuesday, but yeah. yeah. I know, uh, you know, this week, this past week I was in Florida, but Ben, uh, you know, hit up the town, and what would you go out and do? Well, I had a good time. Saturday night, I went with another member of the Do It Indie crew to uh, the Napton Roller Girls Cupid Strikes Back match. Awesome. It was a good time. I mean, Star Wars people were out, the Roller Girls were out, and uh, Indy's own roller guys were there, too. It was very interesting. Yeah, they were big, that? thick dudes. I wouldn't want to get hit by them. <laughs> Not at all, but hey, it was fun. Check out our pictures on Facebook, and we will have a, a video of our uh, second you know, uh, meeting here at the uh, Napton Roller Girls. So it was fun, and uh, you know, it was a good time. You know, thanks again, uh, Roller Girls, for uh, you know, taking care of us. Nice. Well, let's go ahead and uh, get into this week's top five urban events then. What's number five then? Okay, number five. The Indiana State Museum has something that's really cool. If you're from the area, if you're looking for something fun to do, it's called the Odd Indiana Exhibit. So over the past 100 years, as a museum has been collecting things and artifacts from Indiana, they have found odd stuff versus, you know, creates odd Indiana. Right. So they're taking, they took 50 items that they thought were the most unusual that they found over the last 100 years that represent, you know, science and culture and art and like history of the state. So it's a really cool exhibit. Um, you know, and that is at the Indiana State Museum. And that's just one of the many exhibits that the State Museum has. We just think that this would be a good one for uh, family and friends to do. Because but uh, it's odd. It is odd. <laughs> and it's Indiana. And yeah. We're Hoosiers. But uh, that's downtown at White River State Park. And uh, the uh, Indiana State Museum is open Tuesday through Saturday, 9 to 5, and Sunday, 11 to 5. Admission is $7 for adults and $4 for kids. And uh, for more uh, information on that, visit indianamuseum.org. So number five is Odd Indiana at the Indiana State Museum. All right, total number four, buddy. Number four, we've got Who's Bad? Michael Jackson, the <laughs> tribute Ow! band that takes place <laughs> at the Vogue Theater that's right there in uh, Broderpool on College Avenue. It takes place this Friday, February 11th at 10 p.m. It's only $8 to get in the door. I know there's economical. A, yeah, economical, very budget friendly. <laughs> Uh, but I know there's a couple guys in the band. They started where in uh, South Carolina, I believe. Mm -hmm. They started in Chapel Hill in 2004, and okay, I guess it was right. just going to be a uh, just a, a thing, you know. And right. It kind of caught on, so now they are who's bad. Yeah, yeah. definitely <laughs> supporting our Indiana boy Michael Jackson from from the region there. So uh, up north. Yeah. For more information about this event, uh, again, it takes place on Friday. Go to the Vogue. Uh, com or check out their Facebook page and then also the band has a right. web page too it's called uh, whosbadmusic.com so that is our number four event it's Who's Bad Michael Jackson Tribute so. <laughs> alright number three number three okay here we go number three uh, Swing Dancing and Fountain Square Fountain Square is one of the arts district here in Ind arts districts here in Indianapolis and it has a little bit of something for everyone. And about every other Friday at the Fountain Square Theater, they open it up for uh, swing dancing. And what's cool about this is for maybe those people that you know haven't ever twirled, you know, your right. hottie around, uh, they have a lesson. So you can show up at 7:30, and you can get a one-hour lesson. Then at 8:30, they uh, bring in a you know a band and really set up and get going, and everybody you know swings away. I definitely need the lessons. I've done, so. <laughs> I've done it like twice, but you're yeah, probably I, a pro. I, I don't know. I don't know. I kind of, man. But I, I definitely, <laughs> hey, I'm going to go do this. So uh, I want to check this out. I'm definitely going to take the lesson. But it's $12 a person. That's with the lesson. And if you're, you know, that good, you don't need the lessons, you can go and it's $10. And uh, again, that's Friday night. And that's from uh, 8.30 to 11 p.m. And for more information on Fountain Square or Fountain Square Theater, visit uh, FountainSquareIndy.com. So number three, swing dancing in Fountain Square. Number two, buddy. Number two, we've got the 52nd Annual World of Wheels. Yeah. So, Room, room. Yeah, it takes yeah. place at the fairgrounds. It takes place at the South and the Blue Pavilion, uh, you know, pavilions there. Uh, you know, it gives you a chance to go ahead and check out some cool rides, some, you know, you know, rides that are older, hot rides, hot rides classic you know, cars, talk to people about pimping your cars. ride, maybe, you know. So it takes my Versa. <laughs> there you yeah. go. <laughs> Nissan Versa. <laughs> it takes place February 11th through the 13th. That's Friday through Sunday. It's a couple different times here throughout the weekend. Friday uh, from 5 to 10, Saturday from 10 to 10, and then Sunday from 10 to 7. Cool. Uh, tickets are only, how much are they? 
Tickets are, I don't know, we didn't put that down. Jeez, maybe we should have. But <laughs> we know where you can go for more information. Visit www.autorama.com. So sorry we don't have a ticket price on that, but hey, check it out, right? Check it out. Okay. okay. That's our number two. It's the uh, <laughs> World of Wheels at the uh, Indiana State Fairgrounds. So okay. that leads us into number one. Number one for uh, Valentine's Day week 2011. Well, it is celebrate Valentine's Day. Get all romantic. Yeah. You know, I mean, that could be by yourself. That could be uh, with the honey. That could hopefully be, not by yourself. Well, yeah, I know. But <laughs> hey, be urban. Visit a local restaurant. Visit, you know, maybe an art museum, you know, and they have carriage rides. Yes. You know, you go, uh, you know, maybe high class and, you know, the ocean area, you know, uh, St. Elmo's, um, you know, was that Route 9 to 9 in Broad Ripple? You can go yes. over to Broad Ripple. Yeah. Or you can go more budget friendly. Yes. And you could go more like the uh, the big uh, dinner that White Castle has over. You can make your reservations at White Castle or oh, our time. own East Side favorite, the Steer Inn. So, yeah, I know the Steer Inn's got uh, you know, $20 for you know a couple of different options, a four course meal. So, book your reservations with them too. So, <laughs> honestly, at this point in time, if you do want to go out on uh, Valentine's Day, Book your reservations anywhere. Yes, so go ahead and get that done. Think ahead, guys. Think ahead. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. Don't try to do it a day before. It won't happen. Right. So um, if you're single, you're dating, you're married, whatever, just have fun. Do something cool. You know, be urban. Just have a good Valentine's Day. We think it's worth noting. So there's your number one event of the week. Happy Valentine's Day, Indianapolis. Yeah, with that said, everybody. always check us out on YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter. Do it indie, all one word. And also on uh, doitindy.com. And just to let everybody know, this Saturday is our premiere date. Dun, dun, Fox dun. 59, 9 15 a.m. Dude Indy here, Big Ben and Tolan. We will be on the Fox 59 a.m. morning show. So please check us out. Tune Give in. lots of love to Fox. And uh, thanks a lot. So as always, Indianapolis, be cool, stay urban. And until next week, get out and do it indie.